And also the skateboards, um, which I've actually only ever seen through the camera. I've never gone to look at them in person. Have you never played on stream? No, never. I've never played on mainstream at Xeno. <laughs> Not once. Never. Really I've asked it? once, it got cut for time. Hmm, unfortunate. That's and really quad. Funny. Yeah, I've never played on mainstream here. To be fair, I don't, like, really enter. Uh, that's what I leave it to these guys to do, is burst and haze. You know, swinging it here and Hayes really just opening up at a million miles a minute. We're used to Void being the high octane character in this matchup. Hayes says, no, I got to show you. Now, did, like, yes, we. Roy has been meme to be fighting ghosts since 1.0 of this game, but Diddy Kong is a masher character. But right now, his right, thumbs are opposable and they are glued to that A button rapidly. I mean, Hayes has been the one racking up the damage as of late, but Burst did come out of the gate swinging, so Hayes still at the percent deficit. That double edged dance, not gonna find its mark. And oh. the wall jump, Hayes played the movement mix up perfectly, but Burst was dialed in and said, Hey man, I've seen this one before. He said, I'm ready. Swing. <laughs> Got about a 1 2, and now the. The toss putting you off stage, trying to find his way to the outfield. Hayes trying to knock it out of the park, but not able to do so just yet. The barrel's in the... Good, good on Hayes for adjusting his trajectory so he wouldn't accidentally save his opponent. That I'm was, a, that was calculated. This way. We've seen a weird amount of SDs in top four. Uh, yeah. What, what, are, is... what are we doing to these players? I mean, John hasn't yet. Right, so right now, we're back to a relatively even... Oh, my lord. Evening things out. They are I playing love, Smash Ultimate Neutral, if I ever I've seen it. And I love the way that Burst is controlling Banana here. That catch was a little bit over-aggressive, but everything else in the past has really forced Hayes high, especially he's tossing these bananas off stage at ledge, and it looks like he's just tossing it away. Ooh. But he's tossing it away in a position that's also forcing Hayes to burn his double jump and go high, so Hayes... So Bur Burst can find these juggles afterwards. Oh, he barely missed that blazer punish. He wanted the that loving cartwheel into a billion percent. Possibly a kill if he angled it right. Okay, not gonna find it yet. Swinging for the double edge dance. Where were you? Where were you aerial, But instead get the, pa the superior positioning for his troubles. Pushing you on the coast to coast, but leaving the banana behind with no upside to play off of. He's forced to scramble the old fashioned way and just can't get over to where he wants to be fast enough. The overextension is going to give Burst a chance. He can't capitalize on. And Sonic Fiend. Is I this mean, the game? I was going to say, call the eggs the way they are scrambling right now. Yes. Oh my. Okay. You're swinging. You're trying to get something to happen here. That was definitely a missed chair if ever I've seen it. Okay, just watch these empty jumps from from, from, from Hayes in this one. You should right? be gone. He's yes. covering space so defensively around the edge of this platform. His troubles against Burst here have come when he's tried to overextend his advantage state and Burst is calling him out. Out. Once they're actually playing neutral again, it's pretty even. And Hayes has been able to stretch his own very far. He just then overextends and allows Burst to get these reversals for free. That all that wait, okay. Nope, the DI always, plus the platform positioning very strong. Yeah, I was, I was about to say, let me not let me not speak before I curse this man. But if you've been watching Hayes' gameplay throughout the entirety of today, you know. You probably already know what I'm thinking. Wow, Hayes finding the banana up in the heavens to be able to nice. toss it back down, cover his own landing, and keep going. I like trying to cover the getup with Ooh. the banana as well, and that flip kick. Wait, again, just prioritizing space. <gasps> but that's the overextension we're talking about. Have to use the the barrel to get back. And his own banana burst picked it. Oh, did, did burst, burst, did, burst made like the old Planet Fitness commercial, man. He picked things up and put them down. Oh, like okay, because I was very confused as to why that worked that way. But yeah, yeah. I do see it now. The player two icon on it. Mm -hmm. It's like yeah. whoops. It was a blink and you'll miss it moment earlier on, and Hayes knew where it was. I don't think he even noticed it had swapped over. Yeah, he kind of held too far. Like you have to hold that far so you don't get punished by like. Roy things because he's fast enough. He will actually catch you for it, but yeah, unfortunately, just uh, kind of checkmated himself there. And chat, if you're enjoying the stream, you should uh, head on over to all platforms at uh, House of Three Thousand and give a uh, give the gang a follow. And over on Twitter at Devin Three Thousand uh, to support this lovely, lovely local we've yeah. got going on. All, House the, all the matches are uploaded uh, as soon as they finish, and. Uh, 
Also, if you want to do like real-time sharing, we do tweet out like what matches going live right then and there. And if you are, if that's a match that you're partial to like wanting to check out the VOD, uh, the, the first reply to that match will also have a link to said VOD. Talk about organization. That's why these folks are the GOATs. But in House the of 3000 platforms, they are clean and sticky, unlike Smash Ultimates. I'm not going to we'll expand on that we one. We will let you off the platform. <laughs> We're going to get... And speaking of getting let off the platform, Hayes is not going to let Burst get away with that one because he's going to catch him out with the up smash, close out the stock, and keep this one going. Trying to come out, out of the next gate, swinging, and, but Burst over extension going to go unpunished, and now it's his turn Back to try and Ooh. clean it out. Nice call out, but the air dodge saving Bur or Hayes for just one more second. It is so yeah. understated how good it is to have some sort of movement option like Monkey Flip that lets you transition into neutral air dodge because the amount of like the amount of intangibility and how much space you cover during so is so privileged. I say this as someone who abuses spin shot neutral air dodge like my life depends on it and it often does. And Bro. you're gone? No. Can I I swear to god, the thing holding every Sonic player back is their own character because they refuse to learn how to play neutral. I mean <laughs> There's a whole conversation to be said about that. I just don't win because I don't camp. Listen, man, I just saw an opportunity to cook you and I took it, just like these players are trying to do to each other right now. And Hayes, not once again, killing. coming out of the gate swinging, but just not enough. Burst has done such a good job Ooh. avoiding these bananas, but Hayes is now using them like their frame trap, playing like it's corn right now. And I mean, only up one sock. We've seen Burst take these, but Hayes has been playing like a man on a mission. Mm -hmm. The mission to defeat the foul weather setter that is John Numbers. Juan Numeros. And imagine, imagine fighting for your life and having to fight that at the end. In two sets. You need two sets to win. The whole gosh darn shebang. Anyways, congratulations to John Numbers on winning Xenosaga 53. Now, now. Anyway, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. These two players still have a very good shot at it, but we don't even know which one of them will go up yet against Mr. Numbers because they are still duking it out here. I like the attempt at the air dodge read from Burst, but Hayes playing just a little too disciplined to get caught out by that. Burst now trying to find a whole lot more pressure. Has a huge potential edge guard. The banana is going to put you out of the optimal position to find the trap, and Hayes gonna say you not, forgot who I am buddy not watching your step at that ledge falling prey to Looney Tune shenanigans now we staying on PS2 is the question I think you probably do I can't think of anywhere you part much rather want to be I mean PS2 Roy Roy's love town and city I'm just saying yeah I just struggle to see how you leave it legal I was gonna say maybe Smashville maybe a stage like Battlefield as well burst is like feeling like might just help him out because of those platforms i just worry about battlefield because mm -hmm. when you give diddy the top platform they can just get the lead and flip jump away from you flip jump away from you flip jump away from you oh i'm having a bad time banana toss the top platform grab it back but maybe that's why burst wants to go here is to use that banana to or, or the plat top platform to dis disrupt that banana pull as well and here being, because the folks at home didn't see it, we are transitioning to Battlefield. Getting some nice Aria of the Soul action here. We love ourselves some Persona. Now this is uh, Burst's counter pick. And I believe in he can he can definitely make the stage work. He can do work on the stage, 100%. But so can Hayes. Yeah, it's just and a you, and you've given you've given Diddy Kong an extra plus. What the? Okay. Yeah, my man's just mashing up the other shield. My goodness. And I mean, hey, why not, right? We've seen Hayes just get stock after stock after stock throughout this bracket off those barrels. So if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Right? Yeah, but he's been using it like he's a Marth player. In which, oh, you touch my shield even tiny bit? Dolphin Slash. But I mean, I understand how he'd be confused. Roy is on the screen. Yeah, yeah. Except Roy can't reach top flat with his. Probably for the better. Yeah, we don't need to live in that world. Oh, that was a cheeky little reverse banana pluck into forward smash. Speaking of cheeky options, Hayes looking for something even cheekier. And how many times have we seen that one tonight, Sonic Fiend? All right, the Hayes is up big. He's rocking. He's rolling. You're feeling and yourself a little too much off. there, buddy boy. Reel, reel it in just a little bit. Well, hold on. If you're not going to reel it in, Burst might just for you. 
he's trying to find a way to just answer on a whole or tack on a whole lot more extra credit. He was gifted a stock, but why stop there? And Sonic is looking pretty good for him right now. Now can he answer back? Can he make it back to Oh, there's one. Wow, nice. wh what a call out from Hayes. Letting the first monkey flip pummel work out because he's like, I can get jab and put you in the best situation, and then just covered his options afterwards. Said, I don't need to do the simple stuff right now because what I can do is just a pure checkmate instead. <laughs> You're going only one way down, down to the blast zone. You go. You're going away from me, and that is where I need you to go, especially when I am trying to make up a stock deficit of my own making. That being said, Hayes is slowly wheeling this one back in. Ooh. You set, asked him to do it a little bit, and he's trying to bring it all the way back right now, Sonic, because only 20% truly separate these two right now, and Hayes more than capable of finding this stock first. Mm, up throw. That definitely wasn't close to killing. What are we just thinking there? No, I think he was just trying to find a juggle, saying, I don't really feel like I'm in the perfect situation mm. to like edge guard you, so you have the banana, so maybe just, you know, reset and do it all over. Now, whoever gets next blood here will have a massive swing in tempo, which, you know, is obviously what comes with playing this game. Yes, you're up a stock, but I think it's going to determine how the rest of the set plays out. If I may be so bold as to proclaim. I agree. And I think, it's in Hayes' favor. I think especially with how back and forth these two are going, I, I think this game three is incredibly They're important. both very momentous. I also, if I had to pick a player right now, um, I would I would be picking Hayes to win this set. When was the last time you saw Blazer kill in this game? It used to be, it used to be all the time in Smash 4, mm -hmm. but here... Yeah, I mean, you see it from time to time. It doesn't happen a ton, but that's just because Roy has so many good options. And speaking of, we saw Hayes finally get that barrel combo he wanted in full, racking up so much damage and starting to open up this last stock situation in his favor. Now the potential ledge trap position, but those platforms coming in to help burst out. They might not be doing enough, n though, and burst might be letting counter pick advantage slip away from him here, Sonic. Yeah, you definitely want the choice of where to go game five if we get to that situation. Yeah, especially with how close these two have, who have been, right? Going back and forth, back and forth. But it feels like when he doesn't overextend, it's been consistently in Hayes' advantage, right? Hayes is beating Burst, and he's also beating himself when he's losing to Burst. Yeah. And so he just needs to find a way to stay patient, stay disciplined, Ooh. and force, force Burst to play his game. And I think at that point, he's locked the set down. The angle on that Blazer to come back was so immaculately spaced, because if he did it wrong, he was eating an angel drop, and that was probably the game. Yeah, the barrels that like pass that. ledge to my friend, absolutely cleaning it up. Fantastic stuff from Hayes to go up 2-1, and one game away from the potential rematch. Be honest, did you react to those barrels at that position? Probably not. Homie, what do you even do to react against those barrels at that position? You don't. And it blows up everyone equally. Like so! See... You get up. You normal get up. You, you normal get up, yes, but you're collecting your bearings. You're seeing See, Diddy throw out a I, million I, backers. I'm like, okay, I'm going to hold yes. for one second, and then suddenly, uh-oh, boom! See, this, this is where Burst really needs to bring back the old oops did I win tag, because it might have helped him out here. Okay, looking for the just... Pressure string, right? Not true combos at all, but you don't need them if you can just call out your opponent, keep them on their toes, and mm. keep them dancing. And this Roy has been playing a million miles a minute, but Sonic Fiend, it all comes down to these three stocks. If Burst yeah. does not come out on top this game, he is out of the bracket. What can he make happen? He needs to clutch up like he's never clutched up before, which means... Obviously, little room for error. Error? Error? Listen, I, I am error today. All I know, my friend, is what, whatever he's clutching or Hayes is clutching, I'm clutching the edge of my seat because these two have been going at it with some incredibly high-octane gameplay. Finding the banana now, finding the pressure, putting you to ledge, and the edge guard attempt, calling out the air dodge, but just mispositioning it. At least able to get the back though to do it all again. Banana still on stage though, and that miscalculation of resources is gonna give Burst another chance. He's gonna to capitalize on it with the stock and that's a worst case scenario for it's him. really hard to say like at this position 
What can Eever player do to adapt so well? They haven't been doing already. Most of the adaptations have been happening in these small interactions in the middle of the game. Yeah, and I mean, it's that each of those interactions is a new adjustment on a layer, right? Burst jumping in, mixing up those full hop timings, and what he's doing out of it now is something he started to implement off ledge here in this game number four. Or, that being said, Hayes already starting to catch on, right? Trying to catch it out there Ooh. with the up smash, recognizing, oh, you're not doing that anymore? Okay, well, you know what? Up, Let's up and catch away. you back in shield. He's now two stocks away, keeping this one nice, close, and even. But Burst determined to force a game five. You know he's not one to go out Fair. without a fight. Not looking for the Jair there, saying you're not a quite high enough percent. Caught the I don't banana, that could be big. Oh, too close to either. ledge. I like that. Let him up. up! Smash! Bro, he called him out that hard. Because that just doesn't even hit. Like, it doesn't scoop right half the time. Yeah, but no, you committed to get up attack on my shield. Bye bye. And these, these players are still just swinging. Okay, watch this monkey flip. Not going to find its mark. So instead, Hayes going to back away. He doesn't get the banana either. This is the primo opportunity to reset to neutral. That Ooh. banana doesn't have any uses left. It's gone yet again. Hayes tried to grab it there off ledge and couldn't find it. So without this banana, without the burst to threaten, he is trying to find any way to threaten. Well, burst. But that banana now in burst's own control means that I'm going to be honest, Sonic Fiend, I think we're seeing That's, game number five. There it is. You, as soon as you finish your thought, just like, I'm going to will game five in existence right now. I mean, and like, you got uh -huh. it. Yeah. That's what, why do you think I paused a little bit, man? Is I had to make sure it lined up perfectly. I knew if I said I feel it in game you five. You committed. And then this last hit lands, it doesn't good. feel the same. That, that was a great Bro, punish that there. Cool. Recognizing, too, that it's right after Diddy's invulnerability ends, so his hitbox is slightly higher because he hasn't settled back down to make the scoop connect more reliably. Mm -hmm. The timing, the spacing, the callout was beautiful. I would have laughed if Burst had just gone Sephiroth in game, just game five. Just, just to, game five. Just to mess with Hayes. Just to send a message. But I understand why you don't. Hayes going we are finishing it on right now leads. is an absolutely brutal game five pick. Because... Did he get the lead on the stage? Do you know what he does? He literally just can double jump, flip kick to other platform. And even with how fast Roy is, Roy really struggles to contest it. Not just that, you have a whole wall here, mm -hmm. and Diddy loves clinging to walls. Yep, but if you get a little too comfortable on that, right, you can get kind of stuck on it, and Roy will line up that spike. The logistics of which Sunday. are very, very strange. How does Diddy stick to walls with his feet like that? But he holds on. Uh, I'm trying. I'm he not gonna try to think about grippers. it too long, but it's just. Wow. I have. I trust me. I have held on to a quarter inch ledge with my just my fingertips. I firmly believe that he can hold on to that wall. Mm. All the same, let's see how much it actually you know pays dividends in this game five. Oh, what the call out? He not. He didn't read one air dodge there, Sonic. He read two. Yeah, yeah. You definitely had the. Uh, Burst definitely had the time to react, but might have just held in anyway. Just like, oh, I, I gotta get back. I, I gotta get to the safety of the ledge. Psych. Let's when in that situation, he could have Jesus. He could have just uh, jumped back onto platform and wave landed onto it that way. I mean, this is a fantastic set, mm -hmm. frankly, right? Like, you know, as much as we want to talk about it, like, at the end of the day, these two are just playing so out of their minds with the pace, the speed, the level of neutral, right? Everything is a poke. Everything is is trying to trap a landing oh my God, or happened again. or push a position, and the back and forth has just been so delightful to watch. Absolutely, but it all comes down to this, Chat. I need your decisions. One for Hayes, two for Burst. Who do you got your monies on? Not getting that. Oh dear. Burst now on tournament stock, Sonic Fiend. One more to go. And for him to find this victory in his favor, he needs to take two full stocks in turn. The odds are long, but they're not far from impossible. Especially if we can find a man state scramble there. But Hayes gonna give him no quarter, and at 71%, time is running out fast. Man, oh man, oh man. What is a burst to do in this situation? Other than play his heart out. That, that almost, what right there, that was almost... Oh, no! Oh, Hayes giving him a gift when he needs it most. And now he has a chance. Banana in hand doesn't need it. 
so it gets his feet back on the ground and the stage control trying to find a combo starter here it is here's his chance sonic fiend that's a lot of damage hands clammy mom spaghetti it's about to be dropped oh no oh no i smell Platform this one covered. starting to okay. slide between Bur haze's fingers burst might be finding a way back into this all he needs is one burst of action one advantage state a mm. one more hit for either player could very well do this Hit that P4AU action. Hit that one more burst. You need this combo string to finish the job. Not going to find it just yet. What? The parry from both players. This is Hayes' chance. Gets you off stage. Gets Banana back. But because he can't pull a fresh one, there's only the one use That's left. That's so good. Hayes has to be That's careful so with good. it. He's caught a platform, but Burst is going to uh -oh. nick him. Not ready for the flip kick back. Now you have to get off the ledge. Okay, he having did. the jump, so able to get back. But mm. Hayes going to oh. lock it down. He, he held on to that victory Holy. for dear life. Burst came so close. I'm not playing and I'm stressed the hey, hell out. Just remember something. Close only matters in horseshoes and hand grenades. And I don't see any yeah. snake on the screen. And I don't see any horses on the screen. No, sir. The set goes to Hayes. Well fought from both players. That was an excellent show. Um, just a reminder for our folks just tuning in. These folks already played in bracket. Hayes getting sent down to losers by Mr. John Numbers himself. Good old Lemmy's. And you know what that set's count was? A uh, three. Oh. Yep. And Hayes had some potential opportunities, mm. right? Had some pretty good chances. In fact, was even up a game until he yeeted himself off the stage with barrels at zero percent. Until he wasn't. That almost happened. Here. What happened there? He just buffered an air dodge. What? what it, okay, what? Yeah, let's see what sent him in that situation. So he, he just pulls banana, misses ledge, and oh. then buffers a directional air dodge. It looked like he was trying to find air dodge, realized he buffered an air dodge, mm. and then immediately tried to find a wall jump and just did it a little too fast. And so just got the directional air dodge instead. All the same, that was mm -hmm. just an excellent showing.